Phil Collins, Billy Joel, um, Wilson Phillips, Madonna, Paula Abdul. Today's best music. KTI plays it. KTI has songs with real singers. 102 has rap. Rap music, uh, uh, let the 12-year-olds listen to that if they want. that's what they want to hear. KTI never plays rap. I mean, they do not do that. KTI, it's, it's just the best. Station that sounds like fun with lots of music. QFM listeners know what they want. Classic rock with a lot of variety. And QFM listeners get it. We've got a morning show that's really fun to listen to. QFM delivers without the hype. Oh, the repetition. Milwaukee, the bottom line reads just like this. You'll get the rock without the slot. You bet your babushka mama. Keep rocking with 93 QFM. Some weathermen put up a good front, but TV6 meteorologist Vince Condella really knows the weather. So what's it going to be? Well, I vote for lightning. Well, how about sunshine? No, no, this here snow. Oh, snow, you are such a fake. Oh, it's right. Hold it, folks. i got to give a forecast here in five minutes. All right, Vinny, here's your forecast. TV6 meteorologist Vince Condella really does know the weather. Well, it looks like it's going to be a little windy tomorrow with a gun. In Missouri, we're reporting snowfall amounts of about to three inches per hour. Right now, the low is in extreme to Wisconsin, up through the Green Bay area. Lesser amounts on either side. Here in southeast Wisconsin, it gets a little trickier because Lake Michigan's water temperature is pretty warm. So with winds off the lake, it'll cut down on the snow amounts right along the lake shore as the rain mixes with some sleet and freezing rain. One to three inches of snow very likely right along the lake shore. But if you go inwards about four or five miles, that amount can go up between three and six inches of snow. And then west of there, across Washington County, much of Waukesha, western Racine, Kenosha, Walworth, anywhere between six and 12 inches of snow by the time this storm is over with. Haven't you had enough of winter? Be the first one on the lake this year with a StarCraft boat powered by a Mariner outboard from Cedar Lake Sales. Cedar Lake Sales in West Bend is your StarCraft boating headquarters. I'm Don Bell. For 30 years, our family has delivered boaters' dreams with absolute integrity, and we back it with award-winning service. Whether you're the tournament fisherman or the weekend angler, you can own the boat that's followed by the rest. StarCraft powered by Mariner outboard. Hey, I'm not saying that a boat from Cedar Lake Sales can get you a string of fish like this. But it couldn't hurt. The best news coverage in the nation, says the Associated Press, from Channel 12's 24-hour news service. You're watching Southeastern Wisconsin's number one 10 o'clock news with Jerry Tao, Marty burns Wolf, meteorologist John Malone, Tom Sutton, and the Channel 12 news team. Two seasons, winter and road construction, and winter's almost over. A lot of us are going to have to reroute ourselves on the way to work, in some cases starting tomorrow. Good evening, and thank you very much for joining us. A lot of freeway ramps will have to be closed as road construction season gets underway about two hours from now. And this year may be the biggest mess yet. When Kent Wayne Scott asked, what's driving you crazy last year, the top complaint was road construction. Now Kent says, by next week, you'll have plenty to gripe about again. It all started with some warning signs that appeared a few weeks ago. And what those signs foretold were a lot of headaches for thousands of commuters. It begins with the first ramp closing tonight here at the Hale Interchange. Okay, so this is a little complicated, but let's see if we can clear it up for you. Starting actually at midnight tonight, the ramp from Highway 100 through the Hale will be closed all summer long. And beginning Tuesday, you won't be able to drive westbound through the Hale from, say, the airport to McWanago. That ramp will also be closed. And starting next week, during peak rush hours only, the east or southbound ramp at Beloit Road and the westbound on-ramps at both 84th and 60th Streets will also shut down. As an alternate, during non-peak hours, take Beloit Road. But during rush hour, you'll have to take Beloit to 108th Street to Layton Avenue. Now, if that's not bad enough, just travel a few miles north on Highway 45. Drivers there will also be hit beginning Monday. Now with this one, the freeway stays open, but the ramps close. The northbound on-ramp at Watertown Plank and the southbound ramp at North Avenue, they'll be shut down for the rest of the summer. And the southbound ramps at Burleigh and Capitol, along with the northbound ramp from Wisconsin Avenue, will be closed, but again, only during peak rush hours. 
Now, if you travel one of these roads, map out a new route. And also, you better be prepared to hit the brakes all summer long. I'm Kent Wayne Scott, Action 12. If they sold TV news off the shelf, my guess it'd be in a hardware store. In Milwaukee, folks like things practical and useful. TV news isn't much different. Something you can use day to day to help out, solve problems, or show you both sides of an issue. That's what news in this town has to be all about. And which channel does that best? Take a look at your dial right now. Use it to come back to it news time. Go ahead. Take a look. Then use it. Weekend with Gemütlichkeit, German Fest 1984. Three song filled days to rival the best of the old world festivals. Experience the sights, the sounds, the fabulous foods. That wunderbar feeling Germans call Gemütlichkeit. German Fest, more fun for young and old alike with show bands, brass bands, dance groups, and singers. Non stop entertainment from noon till midnight. Get the best at German Fest. Starts Friday, July 27th at Summerfest Grounds. Write that down. The Transportation Department says all of the work should be completed by the end of September, a little more than a week after summer officially ends. Well, in addition to the roadway changes tomorrow... You also need to know this. It's going to be foggy again, and you may not see the trouble spots, so we're going to check very briefly with John Milan, who can tell you what's up in the morning. It doesn't just feel like deja vu. I mean, it's like every night we're talking about fog here, and that's what we still have. Problem is, the northeast winds will not go away, and the humid air coming in off the lake is cooling off over the cold ground and the snow cover we have right now. So more fog in effect. And this is a dense fog advisory, which is just starting to show up now around the area with fog starting to form and visibility is going down. And we're even getting some drizzle being reported now. But this dense fog advisory does continue right on into the morning hours. So all you folks uh, commuting into the Milwaukee from the Waukesha area, Walworth County, Washington County, and right along the lakeshore, Ozaki, Racine, Kenosha, and Milwaukee counties, and now even extending all the way up towards Sheboygan and uh, Port Washington, you're going to see essentially uh, the fog sticking around in the morning hours. A lot of cold air continues uh, to settle in right here over the southeast corner of the state. And with, again, uh, that low pressure system to our south just stuck here, nothing is going to change. As a matter of fact, we might even see a little fog all the way into the early morning uh, hours on Saturday. So. Deja vu do, John. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it seems like every day we're talking about the same thing. All right. Thanks, pal. We'll see you later. Well, while we have motoring on our minds, Wisconsin's old faithful yellow license plates, sort of generation before last license plates, are goners. Come June, all Wisconsinites with current plates will have the white jobs, you know, with the little farm scene along the top there. However, there is talk there may be another license design contest a few years <clears throat> down the road. Jose Diaz died this morning in a bathtub with police there. No one really knows why it happened, but they do know the 35-year-old was arguing with his girlfriend. Neighbors saw him run down that hallway stark naked and screaming. Then he forced his way into Michelle Rivera's apartment. I was sleeping then I saw my father with a shotgun in my, in my room, so my stepfather said, Stand up, stand up, wake up, let's go, let's go. He's like, what happened? I was nervous, all that, I was scared. Rivera's stepfather hit Diaz in the head with his shotgun. Diaz then locked himself in the bathroom, and when police and paramedics arrived, Diaz was dead. The medical examiner has not determined the cause of death yet. They are waiting for test results to determine if drugs might have been involved. We don't believe any charges will be filed in the case. 
A call to Crime Line Anonymous last night helped police toward solving the mystery of Greg Reichert's death. His body was found at 34th and Silver Spring on Tuesday. Last night, somebody called a tip to police. They then picked up the man they were looking for. Crime Line capture number 404. Six months ago, we put Devin Wilson's picture on a Crime Line report, wanted for murder. Tonight, he too is behind bars. Crime Line capture number 405. Anytime you know anything about a crime, 1-800-78-CRIME is the number to call. And you could get up to a $1,000 reward if it leads to conviction. And nobody ever asks your name. This is your free ticket to great entertainment. Because every weeknight at 7, we fill your living room with the sights and sounds of classic movies. Featuring great stars of yesterday and today. TV 24's 7 o'clock Star Theater. Join us and watch the stars shine. Join us Monday night for A Tree Grows in Brooklyn. Starring Cliff Robertson and Diane Baker on the 7 o'clock Star Theater. The Milwaukee Bucks and Los Angeles Clippers. Wednesday at 9.30 on Fox 24. This is TV 24, WCGV, Milwaukee, where the stars shine. Olympic gold medalist, World Cup champion, Wisconsin native, and all-around good guy. Dan Jansen joins David Letterman Tuesday, 1035 on Fox 24. Take a good look at Elvira, because TV24 and 93 QFM are having an Elvira look-alike contest. If you think you can look like her, send TV24 a photo of yourself in full-length costume. Write your name, address, and phone number on the back, and send it to TV24 by Friday, February 8th. You'll have a chance to win a color TV plus other great prizes, and a chance to host your own movie on TV24 dressed as Elvira. Are you the Elvira of Milwaukee? Prove it. Hello, darling. Watch The Real Elvira this Saturday night at 9. She's hosting Dr. Heckle and Mr. Hype, an anti-classic. Like I said, watch The Real Elvira and then compare to me as I host my very own movie. Watch Elvira at 9, then watch me at 11. We really do look alike, you'll see. It's a pog, and it's a picture of you. Pogtography. Your personalized photo pogs, only $2. Call stores for pogtography times. Pogmania at Bart's Party Stores. Pogs are in and now Pogtography. Your personalized photo pogs only $2. Call stores for Pogtography times. It's a pog and it's a picture of you. Where'd you get this? Bart's, the party store. That's great. Call stores for Pogtography times. Today, a high court turned down the money Tiffany Miller needs for an operation to stay alive. She's the four-year-old who desperately needs a liver and intestines transplant, a half-million-dollar operation. Her mother appealed to a federal judge twice, asking Medicaid to foot the bill. But today, the high court turned her down, once again saying it's experimental here. If it was their child, would they feel that the state wasn't obligated to save their child's life? Tiffany's mother says somehow she will come up with the money. Tiffany is on a waiting list at a Pittsburgh hospital where the transplant is not considered experimental. Milwaukee Brewers made another pitch today for their new stadium. Decorations and all at the Common Council Chamber. They presented an update on the new stadium. City's proposed pitching in $16 million to help make highway access to the new facility simpler. We have many needs in this community, including schools, including uh, jobs. Uh, and certainly I think the Brewers fit very well into that mold. The county and state will also help pay for road work. The Brewers will spend $140 million to build the new stadium. And if all goes well, it could be finished by 1996. I'd like to tell you about the incredible music on Laser 103. Pure rock is... Pure rock is... Pure rock is... Your rock is. You have an incredible mouth. Laser 103 has incredible music. If it rocks, it's pure rock. Laser 103.
You've probably seen giggles by day. Ooh. Now see giggles at night. Giggles at Northridge and Southridge features live entertainment, great food, and the coldest beer in Milwaukee. Giggles. After shopping, after the movies. Anytime you're looking for a fun night out with a difference. Giggles. Northridge and Southridge. When the lights come on, so does the fun. 50s and 60s this weekend at Northridge and Southridge. Milwaukee Bucks host the Cleveland Cavaliers live from the Bradley Center Tuesday at 7.30 on Super 18. Do you know who has the world's largest selection of music boxes? Over 5,000 to choose from? Or who has Wisconsin's largest selection of clocks? Over 1,500 on display. Or who has over 2,000 authentic German beer steins? Ooh. Owl Imports, the only shop of its kind in the world. On the corner of 76th and Greenfield. A few years ago, TV6 News brought you the first live Camera 6 report. And the others followed. Then to give you news faster and better than ever before, we enlisted the help of Sky Camera 6. And the others followed. Now, with the help of tomorrow's technology, our satellite Earth receive station Skylink 6 can bring you news live from anywhere in the world. And you can bet the others will follow. Wherever, whenever news happens, TV6 News will take you there. And the others will follow. Well, spring is the season for so many things. Among them, moving to new digs. A lot of folks right now trying to sell their houses. So tonight, Merv Seymour checks out everything from curb appeal to your roof. There are so many buyers out there, and uh, uh, houses don't stay on the market very long. So if, it, if, if, uh, if you have a good, clean home and, it, and it's priced right, um, it should go fast. Folks in the real estate business say with low interest rates, it's still a buyer's market out there. We were expecting probably most of the summer. Alice and Brian Decker are on the selling end, and they're taking advantage of the good market. After one day on the market, their home sold. Only after fixing a few little things here and there. There are cracks in all the ceilings in between the wall and the ceiling, and uh, the woodwork was uh, about the 60s. We had the bedroom floors refinished, and we uh, put in new carpeting. We cleaned out all of our closets, straightened them all out. Home buyers pick up on those little things like neatness of the yard, the condition of the roof, and the overall appearance of the home paint walls and make sure they're neutral colors, make sure that uh, they, they clean closets out and make them look more spacious, um, little things. We decided to add the um, cabinets all in here. Dave and Terry Hayes are hoping the place they call home will rub off on folks in the market to buy. We had to make sure that everything was uh, clean and uh, all of the repairs that, if there were any, uh, were done and that the house was, was marketable and that anybody that came in uh, the first impression that they got was a real favorable one. Realtors say buyers like large kitchens and just the right amount of furnishings. We put a lot of time and effort into what we have so far, and we hope other people like it too. The bottom line in making your home a more attractive sale is to make it look its very best, because if you don't, there's a good chance the potential buyer won't go through the hassle of doing it either, which means he will look for another place to call home. Merv Seymour. Channel 12 News, Milwaukee. One more tip. Encourage the buyer to come and see your house and give them space. When they're looking the home over, that means leave, basically. <laughs> okay. Now, what Mikhail Gorbachev says he knows a sure way for Boris Yeltsin to win back Russian trust and fast, like within three hours. And we'll tell you why Mike Tyson is getting more time in jail. Last year, we put our foster emblem on more new Pontiacs than ever before. In fact, thanks to you, we're now one of the largest Pontiac dealers in the nation. And we're proud that our service department is rated one of the best in the nation, too. We've been here 15 years now, and even though John still talks a little funny, 
We want you to know we love you, Milwaukee. And we're going to keep right on trying to be one of the best Pontiac dealers anywhere. Anywhere. Foster Pontiac. The only thing you stand to gain by putting off joining the YMCA is weight. On the other hand, look at all you have to gain by joining. Call your local Y for information. The YMCA. Don't put it off. Join your Milwaukee area Y and get a free fitness evaluation now through Sunday. Hi, we're the Baileys. Why not enjoy this summer in a park near you? The Milwaukee County Parks are alive. Play the greens at 16 area courses. Match your skills on the courts. Bring the whole family for a refreshing outdoor experience. Yeah, now playing in a neighborhood near you. Yes, friends! One soft words applies. We're blowing away the competition! Hey folks, for the next few days and on a first-come, first-served basis, Dick gives you your choice of either the Commodore 64 or Atari 800 XL for just $129. That's right, your choice of either computer, only $129. Also buy any Commodore, Atari, Apple, or PC Junior software and get the second one at half price. And Dick still includes $200 worth of Commodore, Atari, or PC Junior software with almost every disk drive, color monitor, and even printers. In fact, pay in cash and receive a special discount. That's Dick's Place. Don't miss it. Hey, all you rock around the clockers. Get on down to Wisconsin's largest nightclub, Blue Suede Shoes. Dance to the greatest hits of the 50s, 60s, and 70s while you enjoy nightly drink specials. Rock on to DJ shows, casino nights, the world's largest birthday party, and more. Blue Suede Shoes is located a half mile south of Ryan Road on 27th and Franklin. And right now, the next 20 people to call Blue Suede Shoes at 761-1000 will win a rock and roll party for 10. Call now, 761-1000. If you were to conduct a survey anywhere in the world to identify the number one super premium beer, you'd pick Milwaukee, Beer Town, USA. The Milwaukee Journal did just that. And the number one super premium brand is Heilman Special Export. I repeat, the number one super premium beer in Milwaukee, where people really know beer, is Heilman Special Export. Think it over. You can travel the world over and never find a better beer. The price of the pound just went down. Introducing Sunrise Ground Beef. You've always known Sentry for the very freshest ground beef, and now you have four choices. There's our ground round, premium quality. Sentry Extra Lean, the very best. Sentry's Lean Ground Beef, the family favorite. And now there's Sunrise Ground Beef, too. It's economically priced, so you get a dividend of extra savings. So invest a little time to compare, and you'll see nobody serves you better than your Sentry. Your anonymous tips can help put the cap on illegal drug traffic. Call the Community Against Pushers hotline at 273-2020. They are getting closer to figuring out just who is responsible for the bombing at the World Trade Center. Today, a fifth suspect has been arrested, while three other men in custody were in court filing not guilty pleas. One swore on the Koran and his family that he had nothing whatever to do with it. He's honest. He has no connection whatsoever, and he's well with his mother, and his child, and his wife, and all the friends and theirs. He has no connection whatsoever in this. The fifth suspect surrendered today to the FBI in New Jersey. At the Koresh cult compound near Waco, Texas today, the routine of telephone negotiations and waiting was interrupted by a weird twist. A 24-year-old man named Louis Alanese walked right past the lines of agents, knocked on the door, and was let in. Said he wanted to talk to David Koresh. The man's mother says her son is a religious fanatic who felt drawn to talk with Koresh about the end of the world. The total bill, by the way, for that standoff is now up to $5 million, and the cult members who have left Say the compound has enough food inside to last the people who are still there another two years. Hi, I'm Paul Cagle, Milwaukee Harley Davidson, inviting you to test ride the Harley of your choice at our Super Ride Saturday, June 1st. Purchase any new touring bike, and we'll give you $800 worth of free accessories plus a super four year warranty at no charge. Buy any new sport bike, and you get the four year warranty plus $500 in accessories. 
You know, I come from a long line of Harley dealers, and we've got a great lineup of bikes for you. So take a super ride this Saturday, only at Milwaukee Harley-Davidson, 6312 West Fond du Lac. Six is taking to the air. Throughout southeastern Wisconsin, Sky Camera 6 is helping you stay on top of the news. So now, when you follow the news coverage on TV6, not even the sky's the limit. Welcome, class, to Cousin Sandwich Appreciation School. I want you to examine the cousin sandwich in front of you. See how skillfully the fresh ham and cheese has been sliced into delectable mounds? Regard the bread. Think that's just any bread? <laughs> now taste it. Search your feelings. That's pleasure you feel. Delicious, isn't it? Now, what did you learn about cousins today? Cousins taste great! And don't you forget it. Actress Mia Farrow testified today in the child custody battle with Woody Allen. She's accusing him of inappropriate behavior with their adopted daughter, Dylan. She also says Allen's affair with her adopted daughter, Soon Yi Previn, began when the girl was in high school, not in college. Farrow and Allen are fighting over custody of their three younger children. Mike Tyson's been ordered to spend at least 30 more days in jail, or extra days, I should say. He's accused of arguing with a prison guard about evening phone privileges. They say he insulted the guard and refused to stay in a holding room. Tyson serving a six-year sentence at the Indian Youth Center for raping a Miss Black America contestant. Prosecutors suffered a setback today in the Los Angeles federal trial over the beating of Rodney King. Trying to prove the beating was racially motivated, the judge refused to let them ask one of the defendants about some racial remarks he made describing a confrontation between King and a female officer. 93 QFN, Rodeo and Abdul. Cutter Hay today says, for the best sports in town, they're the morning team to turn to. The Jones Island Dispatch says, for in-depth treatment of school closings, news, weather, and traffic, it's Rodeo and Abdul. The journal's Mike Drew describes them as tasteless and silly. Well, Abdul, at least he didn't say we're ugly. And ugly. That's Rodeo and Abdul. Disrespect mornings on 93 QFM, Milwaukee. Hey man, what you need? What do I need? What do I need? I need to graduate. I need a job when I grow up. I need a future. I need to laugh. I need to have fun. I need to be a kid. I need to be healthy. I need a chance. I need peace. I need friends who care about me. Most of all, what I need is for you to get lost. The next time I push your ass to what you need, let him know. Hang tough.
Magic 96.5. Every game you play. We're playing classics of the 60s, 70s, and 80s. Hey, man, Cheeseburger and a shake, please. Magic 96.5. Have you heard magic lately? The tasty goodness of using your bratwurst has spread by word of mouth. To get a taste of Usinger's fresh or pre-cooked brats, just walk into your grocer's deli department and say the word, Usinger's. Tonight, the United Nations is optimistic about a peace plan that will divide land in Bosnia and stop the fighting. But the Serbs aren't sure they like it. That's where we begin World News Tonight. A three-part plan to bring peace to Bosnia is running into only one roadblock now. The three parts include a constitutional framework, a ceasefire, and a map that divides Bosnia into ten semi-autonomous provinces. Croats today gave it full approval, but the Serbs are still holding out. They say they will have to give up too much land. Russian President Boris Yeltsin went on TV today asking Russians to support him when conservative hardliners try to impeach him tomorrow. Today, Yeltsin's arch-rival also took to the airwaves and said he did not support the impeachment effort. Former Soviet President Mikhail Gorbachev is hearing the news while he's visiting Toronto. He says they need new elections, so the government has credibility. Gorby also believes he could make Yeltsin a shoe-in if he came out in support of him. Says he could turn the tide in three hours. But Gorbachev also says a continuation of the policies Yeltsin is now following will bankrupt thousands of factories and put millions of people out of work and jeopardize democratic reforms. My son Scotty loves fresh baked goods. That's why his mom and I love Sentry. You see, Sentry bakes from scratch, using only all natural ingredients, like Wisconsin grade A butter. And Sentry puts that same quality and value into everything they do. At Sentry, you'll find only the finest USDA choice beef, lamb, and veal. Hey, Sentry really gives you your money's worth on everything they sell. There's just one word for value. And what's the word, Scotty? Sentry. Good times are rolling at Bonanza Park. The dune buggies are here and ready for action. For two-wheeler excitement, hop on a minibike and hit the trail. And everybody's favorite, the Bonanza go-karts are rolling fast in a brand new track. Bonanza also has one of Milwaukee's finest 18-hole miniature golf courses. Check it out. That's Bonanza Park, two blocks south of Rawson on South 27. On the north side, cool off on the bumper post or drive the go-karts for only 99 cents at Bonanza Grand Prix, 8771 West Fond du Lac, three blocks north of Silver Spring. Behind one out of every three doors in America is a person with some form of mental illness. Ginger, do you ever get so lonely you don't want to get out of bed? <laughs> What's her problem? She flunked two courses and she's afraid to tell her folks. You tell me where we're going to come up with the money. Can't you shut that kid up? If you or someone you know is having trouble coping with life's problems, open the door to help. Call this number. If you enjoy computer games and are tired of small selections of software to choose from, Milwaukee's Computer Software Center has a large on-hand stock of the newest and most exciting arcade and adventure games for the Atari 400-800, Commodore 64, and TRS-80 Color Home Computers, all at discount prices. If by chance your program or accessory is not in stock, we can special order it for you also at discount prices. If you enjoy computer games, visit the Computer Software Center at 9805 West Oklahoma Avenue, one block east of Interstate 894, and check out our ever-changing selections. At Circuit City, we have a huge selection of TVs, stereos, computers, VCRs, CDs, cellular phones, refrigerators, car stereos, camcorders, washers, dryers, video games, printers, fax machines, microwaves, speakers, boom boxes, and CD players. All sold at guaranteed low prices. The only problem is, we're not open yet. Opening soon in Brookfield on West Blue Mound Road and in Greenfield on South 76th Street and 894. I guess that means he probably won't back him in three I hours. Don't I don't know. Well, people living along our northwest coast were jolted out of bed this morning. Earthquake damaged several bridges and buildings in the area, including the capital city of Oregon, Salem. 
Although centered in Portland, the tremor was felt as far away as Seattle, 5.3 on the Richter scale. Apparently, nobody killed or even anybody seriously hurt, although a few people did report suffering some minor injuries. Well, our weekend forecast coming up. And tonight, a lifelong volunteer, Fred Washup, our 12 Who Care winner who gets something he's always dreamed of, too. Your GMC Truck and Team Dealers announce 8.8 .8 annual percentage rate financing from GMAC on all new GMC S15 pickup trucks. 8.8% .8 financing on S15 extended cabs, 4x4s, long beds, and short beds. You could save hundreds if you buy now. At Bob Fish, William Dahl, Five Corners, Lakeland, Fred Jones, Rankin Son, Central, Arrow, Metro, J&D, and LeMay and Sons. 400 free movies. You heard right. Curtis Mathis will give you 400 free movie rentals when you buy a Curtis Mathis video recorder and use a free Showstopper Movie Club. And what a selection. Choose some terms of endearment. Sudden Impact. Christine. 400 free movie rentals. A $1,200 value free when you buy a Curtis Mathis video recorder now. And what video recorders? All come with the famous Curtis Mathis four-year warranty. We have the quality. We have the movies you want to see when you want to see them. Get 400 free movies with the purchase of a Curtis Mathis video recorder at the three Curtis Mathis locations near you. Hurry, tune to Magic 96.5 FM, and you can be driving one of five new Pontiacs, yours for a song, actually three songs. Just write down the titles to any three songs on Magic 96.5, and when you heard them, and send them in. Then, listen to Magic to find out how you can win. You might discover a new favorite radio station, and drive home a new Pontiac. Favorites of yesterday and today, that's the Magic of 96.5 FM. Tired of spending a fortune on video games? Then stop and check out RSE Video. Want to sell your video games? RSE Video will buy them. Want to buy video games at great prices? RSE Video has the largest selection of games in Wisconsin with new and pre-owned games starting at only $6.95. You'll find all the hottest new releases and closeouts in stock and at discount prices. Shop one location for the largest selection and get 20% off all used games. Only at RSE Video. Jason Dakota in Milwaukee. We guarantee you'll get the best prices anywhere. The original 21st Annual Camper and Travel Trailer Show is now in progress at State Fair Park. Don't miss it. And Sunday, free parking. Buying a limited edition is only the first step in owning a fine work of art. Proper framing is necessary to ensure lasting quality, and nobody does it better than Amund's Wildlife and Western Gallery. Your investment deserves custom framing with museum mounting, and that's what you get from Amund's. For beautiful bronze sculpture, original artwork, and limited edition prints, see Wisconsin's largest Wildlife and Western Gallery, Amund's, 74th and West Capitol Drive. Custom framing with museum mounting is their specialty. The Inner City Arts Council's Community Arts Festival is coming to the PAC grounds. We invite you and your family to join ours at Odunde, a family celebration of African-American culture. Enjoy the dancers, actors, musicians, craftsmen, and visual artists here at the PAC, Saturday and Sunday, July 28th and 29th, from noon to 7 p.m. It's free. Call 265-5050 for a program schedule. See you at the 11th Annual Celebration of Community Arts Festival. Um, then do yourself a favor. Don't mention that. <laughs> don't tell them what you just told us. <laughs> okay. March Snow next week. Don't and the week that. after, and the week after, and the week after. John, really. Don't mention hey, March that. has been depressing enough. You got that. I'm going to show you something that's going to make March a little easier uh, for you folks to take. But first, let's look at the fog out there tonight. Again, covering the tops of the skyscrapers downtown, the buildings. And yes, uh, the fog beginning to develop just about everywhere across eastern and southeastern Wisconsin and a fog advisory again issued across the southern and eastern half of the state right through the morning hours and again that's all the way from the Wisconsin Illinois border all the way up through Sheboygan Fond du Lac out to the Madison area all of the Milwaukee metropolitan area again right through the morning now maybe this will make March a little bit easier for you to take the 1992-93 whole snowfall season all the way back to October for us 45.5 inches of snow March in Boston had 39 inches of snow, and March in Portland, or, or Maine, I should say, 49 inches of snow. So it's not all that bad here.
It's 36 degrees right now under the clouds and drizzle and fog at Mitchell International, 37, Channel 12, 37 also at Timmerman, 36 is what it feels like because there is no wind at all. The dew point matches that temperature at 36, 100% saturation. We are going to get more fog, the pressure holding steady. 37 in Waukesha, 36 for seeing Kenosha coming in at 36, and under the clouds, temperatures are all pretty much the same, all right around the mid to upper 30s. Here's a satellite close-up uh, through the day. As you see, the clouds rotating around that low, rotating around that low, bringing in the mild humid. This is a Channel 18 weather alert. A tornado watches in effect in parts of the following counties. Milwaukee, Waukesha, Ozaukee, Washington. Conditions are favorable for the formation of a tornado. Continue normal activities. Be prepared to take shelter. Repeating, a tornado watches in effect. Continue your normal activities. Stay tuned to Channel 18 for further developments. Miller Beer, welcome to Miller Time. And the losing team, Bolins, will also get something that everybody likes. Six 12-ounce cans of Jolly Good soda. Yeah. Jolly Good's got it in diet and in regular. It's the bowler's favorite. All bowlers are going to get that big box of Geyser's potato chips because... Be wiser by Geyser's is their motto. That is correct. Be wiser by Geyser's. Tomorrow night, we well, start the semifinals. We hear the four teams that have advanced into our uh, semifinals. Number one team, Wien's Metal Products versus number six, one plus four. We'll have the number ten team, Rain Tree, against the number sixteen team, Wixen Products from tonight. Wixen Industries. Tonight starts... I don't know if you're old enough to stay up, but the terror week... On our movies tonight, The Howling, one of the scariest films ever made. Every night this week at 8 o'clock, we're going to have a... <laughs> Don't you dare miss it. The Howling. Good night, good luck, and good bowling, everybody! The Bowling Game has been brought to you in part by True Value Hardware. More than just a name, it's our way of doing business. Butler Auto Body and Butler and Leonard Auto Body in Wauwatosa. Best of the Tonight Show coming up at 10.30 on TV 18. Record Head, Milwaukee's connection for pre-owned merchandise is now selling records, musical instruments, stereos, and more for less than half their suggested list prices, all lower than you can imagine. Our pre-owned merchandise means super savings, and Record Head's resale shop pays you cash for a variety of items. So if you aren't using it, want to, or have to sell it, stop in or call Record Head for details. Record Head guarantees satisfaction on all sales. For reasons, greetings from Winterfest. When the temperature drops, there's no way to warm yourself up faster than a little ice skating fun. Come on out to Winterfest for tons of wintertaining fun. Enjoy skating in an olympic ice skating rink at Cathedral Square Park in downtown Milwaukee. Don't miss top bands at the Winterfest Ice House, family fun, and more. Winterfest returns November 25th through January 18th. For more information on discounts and activities, call 273-FEST or visit the Winterfest website. Our film today is about steel, the element of surprise. Steel cans or tin cans come in all shapes and sizes for use with a variety of products. Steel is recycled into cars, appliances, and more steel cans. But what really makes steel attractive is that it's magnetic and easily pulls out of the solid waste stream to be recycled again and again. Steel, America's most recycled material. I looked the other way when he got in trouble at school. I didn't say a thing when he'd come home drunk. When he ran away, I always told myself he'd come back. But now he's in so much trouble. I don't understand him anymore. anymore, anymore. 
If your teenager is out of control, call Charter at 1-800-CHARTER. If you don't get help at Charter, please get help somewhere. Now the best deal on carpet in Milwaukee just got better. Mitchell Carpet is forced to sell. Mitchell Carpet must raise cash. This week, over 60,000 yards of carpet, no wax flooring. You save three, five, seven, nine dollars a yard. Sale price includes lifetime patent installation at no charge. 90 days, same as cash. MasterCard and Visa accepted. Guaranteed 48-hour installation. Now if you miss this sale, you'll really be doing someone else a favor. Mitchell Carpet, South 6th and Mitchell, North 92nd and Silver Spring. Sale in progress. Hey, Earl! You can count on Earl Gillespie to cover all the sports. Yeah. When your video recorder goes out, it's a real emergency. You want your set repaired quickly by experienced repairman at a fair price. That's what happens when you take your VCR to emergency TV service at 84th and Burleigh. Their experts repair all makes with the care and dedication you expect at... Take your video recorder to emergency TV service, 84th and Burleigh. If you're looking for help with your home repair problems, watch Ask Gus, Saturday mornings at 10, only on TV6.